DeWine just announced that decision just a few minutes ago. In a tweet, he said, Thank you, President Donald Trump and FDA Commissioner Dr. Stephen Hahn. The U.S. FDA has now given Columbus-based Battelle full approval of the use of the new technology to sterilize these desperately needed N95 masks in Ohio and other parts of the United States. Battelle had been given the okay to sanitize only 10,000 masks, but it has the capacity to do 160,000 masks. That's only in Ohio. Now, the company shared video with us of this process. It uses hydrogen peroxide. Basically, hospitals send in the masks, they spray them down with hydrogen peroxide, let them dry out, and then they're sent back to the, to the hospitals. Battelle says that the mask can be cleaned and reused up to 20 times. Now, a governor called President Trump and the FDA, trying to put pressure on them to let the company go all out when it comes to disinfecting these masks just because they're so desperately needed. Now, this is a big, big step forward in getting those masks for the people on the front lines, doctors, nurses, you know, your, your uh, first responders, that type of thing. Many had been forced to reuse masks or keep them on for just too long. We'll continue to follow this and these masks for now, though, in the Breaking News Center. Dwayne, back to you.